guys, Shea Bear 1000 here. Thought I'd talk to you guys for a minute. Um, I got these in today. These are the parts for the John Deere. Uh, remember the video I did where the, uh, the pulleys were bad, the belts bad? I ordered these Friday. They came in this morning. Awesome job. So, but what I want to talk to you about was while I'm opening these, I thought, you know, what the hell. So tomorrow I'm going to devote the whole day on, on the tractor. Uh, I'm going to sharpen the blades. I'm going to show you guys how to do that and, you know, get that stuff taken care of. So, um, but it was Friday, Friday night. Let's say... Nine o'clock. We're gonna do a live stream. I know a lot of you guys are out doing things uh, on Fridays, but that's okay. But I'm gonna do. It's not gonna be a hangout. It's just going just gonna be a live stream. I'm going to um, do a Q and A, question and answer. So you guys can ask me questions. Don't get too personal. You know, keep it on the lighter side. Uh, you know, like maybe maybe about my channel, you know, how I got started, what kind of equipment I use, stuff like that, you know, and I'll answer your questions to the best of my ability. That way you don't have to write them all down and then wait a week to get the answers to and wait for that video to be uploaded. You can ask me right then and I'll answer them right then. How's that sound, okay? So we've got the belt here. It is the drive belt, which is also known as a traction belt. That's from SureFit. Um, it's a pretty good belt. I've used these before. It was on the cheaper side. Uh, the John Deere belt, the actual OEM belt, was uh, like 30 bucks just for the belt. I got this one for, I can't remember. I don't even know if it's on here. This is just a packing slip. Uh, I can't remember what I gave for it. I think it was like 10 bucks, something like that. Uh, this was all free shipping and now these I got these pulleys they were 16 bucks for both of them uh, I could have got the whole kit but it wasn't from for about the same price maybe a few dollars more I could have got the belt and the pulleys but they wasn't um, they wasn't John Deere so I know the belts not either but the pulleys are so and they do have a one year warranty replacement so I stupid gnats so that's pretty good and here is one of the pulleys this part number is GX20287 and this should be 86 yes G X20286. It's a smaller one. But they are John Deere and they do have a warranty. So so that's good. Um, I've been meaning to put a, a new drive belt on it because uh, was it last year, year before last when I put the uh, I put the blades on it. I don't have that video up. It went on Monkey's channel. I forget how that happened, but it did. And the audio wasn't that great, but uh, so it did go on her channel, but I did do that, and I put some mulching blades on it. And uh, this SureFit is, the part number is, it's a 3 8 by 88.98 inches, which would be a 10 millimeter by 2,260 2, millimeter. Uh, it replaces OE, which is original equipment replacement. It replaces the GX20006. That's 20006. Now the part number on the SureFit is 504-00291. So there you go. There's that. If you want to take a look at that in case you have the same. Because this fits many different of the John Deere's like the 100 series. Like the, uh, it goes from like, uh, the L110s, 100s, whatever, clear up to 
LA 155s or something, which we've got a LA 1 154, but it, it does, it's got, it has all different, it will fit different, a bunch of different tractors, so chances are if you've got one about that size, it's probably going to take this belt and these pulleys, but don't mark my words on that, do your homework and make sure you look it up. When you go to order the parts online, if you, if you click on, like through eBay, if you click on, uh, uh, view description or something like that or more more description click on that and you scroll down it'll give you a whole list of the of the uh, the trackers that these will fit so yeah these were sixteen dollars and seventy eight cents I don't know why this one doesn't doesn't say how much it was got a net bothering me here um, like it'll fit the uh, John Deere, the DEL, which L, the LA. I mean, it, it, it just gives you a few like uh, the 110, 120, 130, 140, 150, 160, and it keeps going, but it's it doesn't. Uh, so, uh, I can't remember what I gave for the belt. Doesn't say on here, but. Shipping was free, so and this of course was like I said the pulleys themselves they were 1678 so it's pretty good we got both of them. So I just wanted to let you guys know that. So like I said tomorrow, so tomorrow evening, stay tuned. Uh, if you're especially for the gearhead, you want to see how to change that and sharpen your blades, pull the deck off. I'm gonna to dedicate to uh, all day tomorrow on that tractor, so that way I can get the, the backyard cut. It's getting high. Um, so, anyway, there you go. But remember, uh, let's go with 9 o'clock Friday evening. We'll do a question and answer video or uh, live stream. Uh, like I said, it, it's not going to be a hangout. It's just going to be, you know, you can comment, ask me a question. Like I said, to the best of my ability, I will answer it. If it's too personal, I will not. But let's try to keep it on the lighter side too as well, you know, let's have some fun. So anyway guys, uh, thanks for watching, appreciate it. Uh, Monkey's at work. Uh, she's got one patient left. She should be home here in a couple hours. So I'm going to make her supper. Got something to do. Uh, the video following this one, uh, I'm going to do a little hack on the scooter. So I've got some parts coming in for it too. I've got a battery coming. I've got uh, so we'll do a video on that too also hopefully this week those parts should be in wednesday or thursday so uh, maybe friday during the day i'll do a video on it um one of them's uh the front brakes don't work um they were hydraulic front brakes so i had to, i lost the uh the banjo bolt for it so i had to order a banjo bolt and the two nuts or the two uh washers <laughs> Man, let me tell you something, man. It's like nine bucks for those two things. Now, the one place I ordered it from is about four hours from me. It's in Miami. They wanted to charge me uh, for the boat like a buck fifty, which is cool, but they wanted to charge me eleven dollars to ship it from Miami to here. It's four hours away. And then I looked at the uh, the washers, which I would have had to buy separate. They were going to be like three dollars, like a buck fifty each, and they wanted to charge me another eleven dollars to ship them. We're talking these bolt, this bolt's like this big, you know, two postage stamps would have covered it. Uh, same way with washers, and I'm like, and I bought stuff, I bought a lot of stuff off of them, high performance stuff for that scooter, and uh, you know, so I I emailed them, and they they got back with me immediately and said, well, you know. Uh, we'll expedite that. We'll, we'll, you know, don't worry about the shipping. We see that you've done. I said no. You know that that's not right. You want to charge me twenty two dollars to ship four dollars and fifty cents worth of parts four hours away? I said that's not even cool. I I'm going somewhere else and get it. And I did. It took me a little, a lot longer um, to find them, but uh, I found them and I and I got them. It still, was like almost nine bucks with tax. And I had to pay shipping on that, but it was only like two or three bucks, which is still outrageous. But it's better than twenty-two dollars. I just couldn't get over it. And I said, "Look, I'm not going to argue with you about this. 
you know, and they were like, well, keep us in mind if you need anything else, you know, uh, put this code in and we'll ship it to you for free. I said, look, I'm not, you know, I'm not looking for something for free. I don't mind paying for something, but Jesus Christ, that was ridiculous, you know, especially, you know, I mean, overseas, it could come from overseas and they, and they don't even charge that kind of money. You know, I've, I've got stuff out of Canada before. It only cost me like $3 to ship. And we're talking heavy stuff. And I'm like, I, you know, I don't even know if I want to do business with them if that's the way they treat a customer, you know. And I just wasn't going to do it. And I'm not going to. That's ridiculous. So anyway, remember, Friday, 9 o'clock, Q&A. Be there or be square. Or be somewhere else having a great time. <laughs> it's up to you. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Shea Bear, Myth the Man of Legend. I'm gone for now. Bye-bye guys. Take care.